that's a storm and you're starting out to be able to see the lake but we're still going out you ready I need to get my rain come, out of my come on babe hi guys so today is actually the first day i think it's rained since we've left mm -hmm. thanks aunt dj and uncle doug yeah raincoats um and we are gonna go get some traditional food yes and oh i have a list of what traditional food we're gonna get thanks aunt dj and uncle doug all right so um, there's a lot of possibilities of what we're going to try today. We found two restaurants. One doesn't open up until 6 p.m., so we're going to have that for dinner. But right now we might be trying Tascaban, which is a stew, yogurt casserole. Uh, stuffed peppers, something called chicken gavecci. Mm -hmm. And that right there is an oven-baked chicken with some ozo pasta shoved into it. And then also something called imam bajeti which is like eggplant stuffed with a whole bunch of stuff in it but the story is that the man who made it he fainted because of how pricey all the ingredients were at least that's what the story i read on the internet said <laughs> and other people said it's because he fainted because of how good it tastes that looks good. all right we'll see you guys there <laughs> Guys, it came with bread. So we ordered a bunch of food and we're going for traditional Albanian right now, but it very well might just more be like the region instead of the country. But it's gonna be good. It looks really good. It's like a chicken and like a like a type of pasta rice. But uh imami it's the eggplant and stuff with vegetables. I think they cooked the pasta in with like chicken stock because there's tiny little bits of bone in there, but otherwise it's pretty good. You just gotta chew very carefully. And we got some potatoes. Hi guys. Alright, so traditional food went decent. Yes, it was definitely a lot of different flavors than we're probably used to, as you guys have seen, we eat a lot of pizza. So we're used to like the heavy, greasy, like cheesy stuff. Mine was really good. I ended up not eating the eggplant skins as much, but the insides, it was delicious. Full of vegetables. It was just very heavy flavors, not totally used to, but. Mine was chicken and rice. Um, it was actually really good. I really liked the rice, except there were tiny little bones that were kind of like yeah. mixed into it all. So I had to. That was cute. So kind of had to fish out. through those. No, not spit it out. <laughs> I had to. I had to separate some of the bones out of the rice, but it was but good. All the, and the, the French fries were amazing. The orzo that they stuffed his chicken with was delicious. That was good. Yeah, they cooked up very well. There was some kind of like lasagna dish looking thing that walked past us. Yeah, you were eyeing that. I wanted to get it, but I didn't know how to ask. Anyway, so we're probably gonna end up going back there at some point, but there's another traditional restaurant we wanna try tonight that's a little bit further up. We'll see how it goes. Now we're gonna walk the boardwalk. All right, guys. <laughs> these buildings next to it. This yacht is like seven stories high. We get to go on the Ferris wheel someday. <laughs>
situation here. Are you excited? Oh my god, I'm so, I'm so excited. So, I read reviews online that were like, it doesn't actually have a menu. It's like what the order of the day is. I thought it was going to be like a few selections of what the order of the day is. No. He's like, you want the order of the day? He said yes. And then he left. So, he said fish or meat? Oh yeah, that too. But he came back and asked that. Um, I'm so stoked. <laughs> It's just, I love the decorations. You keep laughing at me. Oh, There's so much food. He comes up. This is the starter. He goes, this is the starter. <laughs> he went through what every single thing is. I know it's a ZP. And then that's fossil peak, something like that. cucumber. This is an Albanian vegetable. They said, yeah, this is all Albanian. That's Greek. Spicy cheese. He said uh, so it's mixed with Greek and Albanian stuff. And that's bread. I am literally so excited. This is, this is a lot. This is a lot of food. He just showed up with both of our meals. We got a fish mm -hmm. and the chicken and rice. And we only had time to try these three things. Which this is cucumber. Cucumber, beans, beans and potatoes. Mm -hmm. And um, <laughs> you excited? <laughs> this is my favorite place ever. This is amazing. Like all these tiny little dishes, like they're so good and they're not too filling either. The fish was delicious. The potatoes and carrots that came with it were great. I'm in love with you, of course. And this place. He said, now these are traditional biscuits that he made from home. Stay in the right. So I stayed in the right. I don't even know what this is. Okay, right, guys, so we are back. We got a lot of food. It was good food. It was very good food. It was very good food. It was a lot of it. Many, like, little side dishes and stuff. Chicken and rice was what I got, and then I got the fish. Mm -hmm. It was good. A lot of little bones. I forget when you get, like, a fish. There's it's like there. a chore, but that was good fish. And then after eating, we walked around uh, quite a bit, and then we came back, and then yes. it started pouring, and it poured all over our drying laundry. Outside. It was, like, when we were leaving, it was already almost dry, too. But it's, it's kind of soaked. All right, guys, we'll see you tomorrow. Nice. That, that's going in it. We'll see you guys there. All right, we're gonna go get food now. There you go. Wanna explain what that is? Bye bye, Jeffy. Bye, Jeff Bezos, few million dollar yacht that we just you found mean. out. How many million? 500 million. Five, holy. Do you know what you could do with that? <laughs> oh my gosh. Like every single person here could eat free. That's insane! <laughs> Hi guys.